There you are. Did you sleep well? If you want that bicycle for Christmas, you need to start doing chores around the house. Take the garbage out, for instance.
I hate to tell you this, Mr. Wagner, but it seems your handyman was drunk as a skunk. He was an accident waiting to happen. I was going to fire him after the other incidents, but I just didn't have the heart. It's hard enough to keep the staff here with recent events. You can't blame yourself. This might be the worst case of professional neglect I've ever come across. While this might explain the gas leak, it still doesn't explain the death in the walk-in cooler. The autopsy on the mate was inconclusive, but we're still working on the theory she had a poor heart or circulation problems and fainted. some new lamps, will you? I need to keep working here.
Buy me some new labs, Lucius. This situation is ridiculous, Mr. Wagner, and I'm holding off the Bureau from launching an inquiry. I'm posting a deputy at the house. It's more for your own protection. I wish I could explain these as more than accidents, but I can't think of a motive. I can't imagine how anyone could have gotten away with this. We'll get to the bottom of it. Just consider this house on lockdown until something comes up. It wasn't a pretty sight. Heads sawn in half and blood everywhere. These freak accidents are keeping me up at night. Four deaths in four months, all apparent accidents. But I had my doubts. I still had no clear suspects, no motives, no way to even start an investigation. At this point, I was only sure about one thing. It was not going to end here. I was right about that. Another month went by when we got the call to go back to the house. But this time it was different. This time... It was murder. <laughs> 